everyone welcome back to my channel and to another video so in today's video i wanted to share a really delicious dessert that you can make at home it doesn't require any baking or cooking and it's an oreo based dessert and it's honestly so so good you will want to make this in the holidays and add it to your table it's honestly such a good one and it's super easy to make so i'm going to be making it in these gorgeous little glasses these are actually wine glasses but i'm going to be using them as dessert glasses i got these in home bargains but you can find these in most stores so the main ingredient you're going to need are lots and lots of oreos i got this huge box in farm foods I did try and look for multi packs but I couldn't find them in other stores maybe they're sold out I don't know but you just need quite a lot of these I will link everything in the description box below the measurements and ingredients in case you want to see exactly how many I'm using then you're going to need some cream cheese I'm using Philadelphia you're going to need some double cream as well then we're going to use just a little bit of butter and the last ingredient you're going to need is a little bit of icing sugar so let's go ahead and make this absolutely gorgeous dessert. So to begin with, I'm taking a Ziploc bag and I'm going to add in my Oreos and then I'm going to crush the Oreos with a rolling pin. If you have a food processor, then this will be so much quicker, but because I don't have one, this is how I'm going to crush them. Now they don't have to be super super fine but try and get them as fine as you can so this is how mine turned out so I'm just going to take a dish and I'm going to empty out all the crushed Oreos into this. Now I'm just adding in some melted butter and with a spoon I'm just going to give everything a mix just to coat those biscuit crumbs in a little bit of butter to hold them together. Now set this aside and grab yourself a large mixing bowl and to this I'm going to add in some double cream and then I am going to add in three tablespoons of icing sugar. Now I'm just taking a handheld whisk and I'm going to whisk my cream until it is nice and thick. So we're just going to continue to do this until we have stiff peaks. cream is now looking great so it's time to add in the soft cheese so I'm going to add in the whole tub and then I am going to go ahead and continue whisking until both ingredients are really well combined. So once you have whisked really well it's now time to add in around half of your crushed Oreos so I'm going to add those in and then I'm going to switch to a spatula and I'm going to gently fold the biscuits into the cream and cream cheese mixture. Just be really gentle, you don't want to over mix it, you just want the biscuits to be well combined in this mixture. So now that my mixture is ready, I'm just going to scoop it into a piping bag. It just makes it so much easier when you are trying to fill your little plastic cups. So I've got my cup set out and I'm going to start by adding in some of that biscuit on the bottom and then we are going to top with our filling. So I'm just going to generously pop some in there. You can use as much or as little as you like. This dessert is very rich, so just bear that in mind. You can use smaller cups, maybe those little plastic shot cups, but this is all I could find. So once I've done this, I'm just going to repeat the process. I'm just going to pop maybe a couple of teaspoons of the crushed biscuits over the top of the cream filling and then I'm going to add some more cream filling over the top.
Now I'm just going to sprinkle over with some more crushed Oreos. This is just to make them look nicer. Just look how gorgeous they are looking already. And once I finished with this, I decided to pop half an Oreo on each one just to finish it off. And here are our desserts. They are all ready now. It took no time at all. So make sure you try these. Okay, so our Oreo desserts are now ready. How amazing do they look? Honestly, you have to make these in the holidays. They are so amazing. They just look so good. And it looks like you worked really hard on these when really it didn't take you long at all. Just a look at that. So we have layered the Oreo biscuits and then the filling that we made and it just looks delicious. And I just want to show you how smooth this filling is. Look at that. Are you telling me you don't want to take a bite of this? Give this one a go. Let me know if you try it. Let me know what you think of it. Is it your kind of dessert? What kind of desserts are you making in the holidays? Let me know in the comments below and I will see you all in my next one. Take care. Bye.